Since the beginning of the refugee crisis, European countries have naively welcomed throngs of unvetted migrants across their borders, with devastating consequences. One mayor who has grown tired of catering to the demands of refugees found a simple, yet effective, way to show them where they stand by putting an epic surprise in their school lunches. Michel Rotger is the mayor of a relatively small French town called Chavigny saint sauveur He also happens to be a staunch conservative, when the burden of providing specialized school lunches to Muslim students, who are forbidden from eating pork, became too great. He showed where his priorities lie. The mayor of Chavini Saint Sova has announced that he will ban alternative school lunch menus that exclude pork to promote secularism. Mayor Michel Rotger is a French conservative who is saying no to accommodating Islamic tyranny, insisting secular values be upheld in public schools in Chavini Saint Sava. Source: The Gateway Pundit. We are putting an operation in place so the children eat everything and their diets are balanced. There is too much waste so we will teach them to eat meat, be it poultry or pork, said Rotger, according to Breitbart. Of course, schools should not be forced to cater to Muslim immigrants, especially when it affects their bottom line in a way which isn't sustainable. Do these same schools offer fish options to Catholics during Lent? Do they offer their Jewish students a kosher lunch? No, they do not. All of the negative consequences which have arisen as a result of mass Muslim migration can be traced back to one source, by and large. Muslims who come to Western countries from the Middle East have no intention of assimilating to the culture in their new country, despite the bevy of advantages that culture affords them. So, the question we must begin to ask is this, why? If the culture was so wonderful in their country of origin, did these Muslims want to leave in the first place? And, why not adopt the customs of Western countries if they were so quick to flock to them? The answer is not something which the left wants to admit, but which will be the downfall of Western civilization as we know it if we continue to allow unbridled migration by Muslims, many of the Islamic immigrants who have taken up residence in countries like France, Germany, Sweden, and even the United States have more sinister motives that the left would have you believe. Many of them come to Western countries specifically to change the culture there, and they are being assisted by liberal politicians who make every concession for them. Mayor Michel Rotger has made the right move by cancelling the specialized school lunches for Muslim students, effectively letting them know where they stand. If they want the opportunity to be educated in schools which are far superior to anything they would have experienced in Iraq or Syria, they can eat the same food as everyone else.